There's a lot of hiking trails around Provo, but today I picked the Silver Lake Trail. It's a freezing 34 degrees, but we're gonna do it today. <laughs> Here's a little bit of what the drive looked like coming up, and it was spectacular. Are just darn terrible. All these beautiful aspen trees are all carved up. <laughs> My shoes are not made for this rock. <laughs> that German lady was right. These shoes are not good. <laughs> not alone. Another high altitude hike? Yeah. Whew. I need to get in shape. Or... <laughs> the altitude really kills you. <laughs> Fantastic up here. Saw something dead up the trail and there were like some fairly fresh cougar tracks around so we just wander back the other way. We're not really going anywhere in particular, so you can't go wrong up here. get another A plus on hike selection. <laughs> that was the Silver Lake Trailhead. Remember that, the trailhead, because it's totally different than the Silver Lake Trail. I don't know why, one's difficult, one's easy. On this one, you will have to pay a day fee unless you have a park pass. Hey, it's $6, but I'll take a picture of the sign down there. Or scan that QR code off the screen right now, and I'll give you all the information you need. Yeah, but it was fun, but definitely intermediate. Yeah, take water, leave early, be ready for altitude gain. And don't go during a snowstorm. <laughs> we'll see if we can find some food. That sounds good. Story of our life. Hey, let's take a short walk and then go look for food. <laughs> Next stop on the Provo food tour is Mo Betters Hawaiian food. Mo Betters. Mo Betters. Mo Betters. <laughs> Let's go try this. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. This place smells amazing. I've got katsu and teriyaki. Of course, famous mac. Yep, good macaroni cheese. Macaroni, <laughs> no cheese. 
moist, crunchy. I like this place. Oh, ho, ho. giddy up. This really is the spot. Oh, that is so good. It's a good thing we don't live here. We'd be eating here all the time. Well, after hiking all day and feasting on Hawaiian food, we had this great plan to go out to do the haunted forest. But instead of running around in the cold, we went to a movie. The first time we've been at a theater in months. It was pretty good. Yeah. yeah, good one. There was no one in the theater, so it was really nice. And now we're going to be old and go hang out in the room. So yeah. that's not exciting. <laughs> We're wandering around color. Do, do you want me to do it? <laughs> yeah, you do it. <laughs> <laughs> he tells me all this stuff like, I? <laughs> You're not wandering around Colorado, I'll tell you that right now. Oh, that's right, now. we're Utah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were saying on your you way. You could say, we were. I, I thought you were saying, yeah, or you were, you were saying you were on your way to Colorado, because that's that's true. true. We right are on our way to Colorado. But, I never know yes, where we are. But. <laughs> well, we are in Park City, Utah. We've been hanging around in Utah for a bit and we met these guys in Cozumel at a coffee shop, strangely enough, and they saw our ducks here and we're like, hey, we're from Oregon. Go ducks. Go ducks. <laughs> we're excited to reconnect now in Utah. Now you were blogging. I was, I wrote a blog, bake, <laughs> no, well, I wrote two blogs, bakerybingo.com and then also Bingo Abroad, which documented our travels around the world. And there's no more of those happening. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's, uh, Easy you guys did what 48 countries in 24 months? It's something, close to that, yeah. something about that, yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely. That's a crazy pace. Did, did a lot and uh, circumnavigated the globe. Ducks travel. Yeah, <laughs> gotta get out there, meet other ducks all over the place. We actually met another duck when we were in Cambodia a oh. couple years ago. Yeah. So did we. Yeah. Was, was he from class of 76? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one, one peg leg? Yeah. yeah. Now we're gonna get to our favorite part food. <laughs> You're like, I haven't done my food blog in a while. I'm not used to being filmed. I finally convinced her to start eating the food. <laughs> Enjoy. In the habit of, uh... You guys did pictures, you didn't do videos. Yeah, no. Which is nice, because then you don't hear me talking off to the side while you're messing with your burger. I think I just, yeah, I get you uncomfortable doing videos. That's a good burger. Wow. It looks amazing. Ooh, that spicy mayo is spicy. It's really good though. I got the oh. G free burger. <laughs> you have the same spice as I do? Yeah. I'm like, whoo. <laughs> so and yours has the sauce on the side? Thankfully. Well, I just tried the sauce. Oh. That was that was the mistake. Bryce just got spiced. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna chat and visit and eat. Great to see you guys again. Yeah, you too. Just driving along the highway and saw Bridal Veil Falls. I couldn't resist the opportunity to stop off and check it out. <laughs> it was actually one of the hikes Kate had picked for us, but I think we missed the hike. I think we did. <laughs> There's a lot of ice. It's kind of back in a canyon, I guess. Yeah. Want to scamper up a little bit or no? Uh, you can, but I wear oh, long shoes. That's right, you're not wearing hiking shoes. Uh uh. Hey. And I think that other trail for this one. Why don't you want to go yeah, hiking? Yeah, that's not going to work. <laughs> we see the coolest things just looking off to the side of the road and just stopping on a whim.
Leave the thumbs up and subscribe. No, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>